Hello, freaks. If you're still awake right now, then congratulations. But most of you are probably getting your beauty sleep at this point, but you'll see this in the morning. I just wanted to uh, bring it up because I stumbled into this a while ago and I could not figure it out for the life of me. Uh, I've been a pretty avid photography hobbyist and um, I know my way around a camera a little bit. I worked for Sony Electronics for a while uh, with their incredible line of cameras which really still to this day are my, still my favorite. Um, yeah and so uh, in the last couple of years I've been just pounding the pavement as far as webcams go and I have not seen this anywhere else until now and uh, a f Facebook friend of mine a uh, fellow Nibiru watcher sky watcher had brought this up in one of the groups and uh, asked what it was and I recognized it right away because I had seen it before um, but just so that we all get uh, on the same page uh, and I also just noticed that Naughty Beaver had just also popped up and posted a live stream just, well, not too long ago, a couple hours ago. And he had sort of asked somebody if they could record the ending, the happy ending. We all want to see a happy ending. Oh, look, synchronicity, 333. Um, yeah, anyway. So, um... I just noticed that sun has broke there, but I wanted to show you this first. For those who haven't had a chance to see it, this has appeared in this live camera. Uh, I'm, I'm back a few hours now because the sun is coming up, Aaron. I'll show you that in just a minute. Um, but you see through the evening, what appears in the camera is a very bright green almost like a Roman zero like a Roman font style zero <laughs> that's the graphic designer coming out I guess but um, yeah some kind of weird effect now I saw one other person had suggested that this was part of the camera or some sort of camera anomaly camera related issue um, but again I've got a fair bit of experience working with cameras I've been watching cameras a lot and again this is only the second time I've seen this phenomenon that does not I'm not saying a, at all that this isn't some sort of technical factor but why <laughs> why would this appear in a camera there must be a reason uh, and that's what I'm seeking <clears throat> just seeking truth that's it so if anybody else knows why this bright green circle is appearing in this particular camera and as well the ones that I ran into before I gotta hurry up and make this video because well the fucking day's gonna break here pretty soon the National Radio Astronomy Observatory look at their cameras North Liberty Fort Davis Owens Valley Kitt Peak Pie Town looks like it's got something black and white camera but and these are real-time photos, so these are coming like every 10 minutes or every 15 minutes or some some, some shit like that, right? <coughs> I mean, what is this? This is freaky. Freaky deaky. Now, it very well could have something to do with high levels of infrared, high levels of UV, affecting the camera in some strange way. I don't know maybe it's light being directed through the solar lens array that's quite possible right that's quite possible we just don't know right uh, we're all trying to figure this out right now but let's take a look and watch the sunrise I'm just gonna as the night progressed one thing I noticed um, was the light all along here which once the Sun comes up you'll see it's a coastline or sorry uh, there uh, Actually, to be honest, I don't remember even if there is a coastline. It's boats. That's right. There's a bunch of boats that are here. Now, I was watching, and I just kind of like watched for a couple minutes, but there's all kinds of twinkling and winkling going on in the sky here. It is hard 
to see and it is purely interpretive go ahead you feel like watching the full length you got a couple hours left still before you can uh, this one goes back four hours I believe yeah four hours so uh, those of you who get up bright and early you want to check it out you can still skim back four hours and see, and see this uh, as it progresses so as we go through the night I, I'll just skip because it's just well the odd twinkle the odd blinkle who knows I, did, I don't have four hours to watch it but um, I did want to show it look look at this shit check this weird effect out now I do think this weird blobby effect I think it's raining and these are droplets of rain running down the camera but it's pretty cool just the same like where what are all these lights boats they're boats or buoys perhaps uh, maybe a, the edge of a wharf <laughs> we'll get to the sun when the sun comes up but yeah all kinds of weird weirdness with the rain falling on the camera it's pretty hard to you pick any detail out I suppose I could put it up in quality couldn't I that would help yeah YouTube has been freaking I'm sure throttling me whenever I go to high def just gives me a hard time but that doesn't look much better anyways it's not a super powerful night camera I don't see any stars or any definition in the sky unless it's some sort of frequency interference which is very possible I've been seeing that in cameras so yeah check this out as the sun comes up we see the green circle is fading and vanishing but what are those I wonder hmm little floating black discs what's this over here this could be dirt left from the rain who knows I haven't really watched this yet so we're all seeing this the first time together but seeing one down here kind of makes me think that's probably lens dirt let's see if it moves nope not moving so I'm gonna guess it's lens dirt but as you can see that the green circle is just fading off with the sunlight oh wait now the sunlight's fading off who knows with these friggin sun hours these days like the sun gets up whenever it feels like goes back down comes back up Sometimes, you know, you get the white light in the back, the yellow light in the front, the sunrise, sun simulators floating all over. Who knows what the hell's going on here? Who's in charge of this ship? Anyways, speaking of ships, what I did notice is, what the heck is this here along the front? Let me move my cursor. What is that on the front? <laughs> is this where they hold bathtub races? I think this is the bathtub race start line. That is amazing bathtub racing boats I'm sure that's what it is see that's why I'm in this investigative game to get to the bottom of the stuff bathtub races sketch totally there's some sketchy business going on here but as you can see our green UFO has vanished I am more of the opinion that it is something the cameras are picking up it could be off the lens array Again, it could be infrared, it could be ultraviolet. All of these things are things that are clearly present right now. And I mean, even here, you can sort of see the purple tint, right? That purple tint is popping up everywhere. It's popping up from the space stations, popping up from uh, every, people's photos. It's popping up at the night sky, glowing purple. Like, it's everywhere. So, purple, violet, ultra, it just all fits together in my mind. Like, it's got to be related. It has to be. <laughs> I, I almost feel like I've been beating this horse to death so much. I mean, I started pointing out purple imagery coming from um, webcams oh, a year ago, almost a year ago. And, uh, you know, it just keeps happening, right? It keeps getting more prominent, more prevalent, brighter. You know, this is definitely going to be affecting people's vision. Um, you know, frequency the whole atmosphere really with this amount of light flooding our atmosphere it's bound to have an effect on the atmosphere's frequency because it's not from our normal visible light so you know just something to keep in mind something to be aware of 
the more you're aware of it, the more you'll think of it. Maybe the more uh, you'll come up with it. There are possibilities, theories as to why. Why the sky is turning purple. Why we have giant green circles appearing. Anyone has any input, I would love to hear it. Please leave a comment below, a hug and a kiss, and a like, and a click, and a subscribe, and bell thingies, anything you can click. Just start pushing buttons for me, okay? Right now. Smash it. Thanks.